All right, Shalom, Shalom. First off, let's give all honor, glory, and praises to Yahweh, Bahashem Yahushai, Bahashem Rakakodash, and double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone who teach and rule well. Uh, I am not a member of GMS, however, I learned the truth from them. Um, so just want to give credit where credit is due, and um, and shout outs to all you, all the other brothers um, preaching this word in truth and sincerity throughout the four corners of the earth. And shalom to you, striving and sincere believers. All right, um, yeah. So lately, I've been doing a, you know, a few health videos, and um, I mean, you could you could report on this every day <laughs> until your Howard Shaw comes back. But I did find this article recently. It says FDA recalls blood pressure medication over cancer risk. Okay, so here it is. Esau is trying to give you. And um, Salakia for the background noise. That's uh, fireworks going off. This is uh, the so-called New Year's Eve. So these Babylonians um, are getting in the spirit, getting in the character, and worshiping the beast. All right. And it's just nothing but folly. But like I said, excuse the background noise. Okay. So the FDA. What is the FDA? Okay. We hear about the FDA all the time. Okay, so I typed in FDA meaning it's U.S. Food and Drug Administration. Now you gotta you gotta ask yourself if you have asked yourself already, why would one company <clears throat> be Food and Drug Administration? Wouldn't shouldn't it be separate? Okay, but how Esau does it, this food that he feeds the people is a drug. Okay. And it does things that drugs do. Okay, so it's under the same banner. Alright. So that's 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 a red flag in itself, okay? And um they're administering drugs through food, okay? So we all know how slick and um how conniving and uh how cunning this devil is, but in all actuality, the devil is in the details, man. Okay, the devil is in the details, and that's how Esau gets you. It's it's through these a lot of these contracts, the fine print, this, this jargon, this uh, endless jargon that he um, spews on these contracts, and these these contracts bind you to him, meaning you're you're a form, you're a slave to that contract. Okay, it's not a physical uh, slavery. It's uh it's a uh, is contractual slavery if you will and, and these rich jakes feel it even more so than us okay but the devil is in the details okay and um it tells you let's get a scripture okay let's go to genesis 3 genesis 3 verses 1 now the serpent was more subtle than any beast of the field which the Lord Yahweh had made. And he said unto the woman, Yeah, have God said you should not eat of every tree of the garden? And the woman said unto the serpent, We may eat of the fruit of the trees of the garden, but of the fruit of the tree which is in the midst of the garden, Yahweh have said ye shall not eat thereof. You should not eat of it, Salakia, neither shall you touch it, lest you die. Okay, so the point, some of the point is in verse 1, okay, where it says, The serpent was more subtle than any beast of the field. Okay, now this serpent was a man, it wasn't, it wasn't a, um, it wasn't a snake, it was a, a guy with serpent like qualities, okay. Yeah, how is y'all always compare people to vipers and and snakes and serpents, man? Okay, so that's what that's talking about. But, you know, if you read on, the, the serpent tells a half truth, a half lie. Okay, with your half lie, it's still a, it's still a lie. It's a full lie. Okay? Okay? And, um... 
verse 5, For Yahweh do know if that in the day ye eat thereof, then your eyes shall be open, and ye shall be as gods, knowing good and evil. And when a woman saw that the tree was good for food, and that it was pleasant to the eyes, and the tree to be desired to make one wise, she took of the fruit thereof, and did eat, and gave also unto her husband with her, and he did eat. Okay, so the the idea of this, okay, it, it came from Esau Edom, man. Okay? So Esau Edom feeds you one thing and you get another. That's why I had brought out the um, Genesis 3. Okay? Now, let's get that where it says, the any beast of the field. Okay? All right. Let's go to Matthew. Matthew 13, verses 38. The field is the world. Okay? So showing you this. This serpent was a, a human. Was a, a man. In the world. Okay? The field is the world. The good seed are the children of the kingdom. But the tares... Are the children of the wicked one. The enemy that sold them. Is the devil. The harvest is the end of the world. And the reapers are the angels. Okay. As therefore the tares are gathered and burned in the fire. So shall it be in the end of this world. For the son of man shall send forth his angels. And they shall gather out of the kingdom. All things that offend and them which do iniquity and shall cast them into a furnace of fire, there shall be wailing and gnashing of teeth. So for for the wickedness of this devil, you know, he's gonna get burnt up, man. Along with his children, his tares, man, which there's a lot of Moabite tares, Moabite looking tares, I should say. You know, Edomite foreigners, <laughs> you know. From all these nations, because he put his seed in, and it, and it's a lot of in that's in uh, the land of Ham too as well. Okay, so the field is the world, man. Okay, let's get some of this article. Let's see what it says. Okay, now let's get a um a antonym of medicine, which means something the opposite of what it, the actual definition is. Okay. So it says, antonyms, medicine, falsify. And that leads me to, you know, when you doctor something, you're falsifying it. When something is doctored, it's, it's false. Okay, so why would you name your so-called physician doctors, man? It doesn't make sense, man. So that's him being subtle. Okay, it's him being subtle. All right. So, FDA recalls blood pressure medication over cancer risk. So, people are getting cancer. Okay? So, it's called, uh, it's recalled four lots of his blood pressure medication, quinapril tablets, because of an impurity known as nitrosamine being found in recent testing of the product. Okay? These purities, impurities are found in meats, dairy products, and vegetables, and increase a person's risk of developing cancer when faced with prolonged exposure, according to the FDA. So, who's to say these people didn't come in contact with it for an extended period of time? And what does that do when people get cancer? Most people get cancer. It feeds into Esau's system. You know, it feeds it with more money. Okay. Esau's system is a well-oiled machine, man, in wickedness, all right? But this truth is um, it is taken away from this man's kingdom, and, you know, he's losing a lot of money. The more of our people wake up, okay? Now, let's get uh, Ecclesiasticus and the Apocrypha, okay? 38. 38 verse 4. 
The Lord have created medicines out of the earth, and he that is wise will not abhor them. Okay? So he has the opposite of medicine, which is, uh, he's got diseases for you, man. Okay? And, um, when you trust in this, man, especially for your medical care, man, you're playing Russian roulette with your life, man. Okay? Let's jump to, uh, Psalms, um, Psalms 58. Verses 3. The wicked are estranged from the womb. They go astray as, as soon as they be born, speaking lies. Okay? So, when, so Esau eat them. These people needed blood pressure medication, which there's certain fruits and fr uh, roots, fruits, herbs, and vegetables and spices, man, that you could take um, for your blood pressure. Okay, turmeric, garlic, all right, uh, cayenne pepper, um, just to name a few. These, these are good for your blood, man. And anything, any fruits that's like reddish to like purple is, is going to be dealing with the blood. Okay, so you want to like red onions, okay, um, cherries, dark, any dark berries. Um, the dark leafy fruits that l almost look purple, those help with your blood, man. Okay, and um, Esau Edom doesn't teach you things of that nature. So the wicked are estranged from the womb; they go astray as soon as they be born, speaking lies. So whole the whole Esau's whole medical system, so-called medical system, is one big lie, man. Okay. Their poison is like the poison of a serpent. They are like the deaf adder that stoppeth her ear. Okay. Their poison is like the poison of a serpent. Okay. And I said the serp serpent was more subtile than any beast of the field. Okay. And he's the wicked. The wicked. Okay. He is the wicked. Okay. Let's do something real quick. So I can. Okay. Let's get something. I got another article for you. Here's it right here. Here's the one. It says, Common arthritis treatment may actually accelerate disease progression. Osteoarthritis is a degenerate joint disease that causes cartilage in a joint to break down, leading to pain, stiffness, and difficulty moving. It's a common condition that often affects the hands, knees, hips, and spine. Okay. Obesity, da-da-da. Okay, osteoarthritis is a widespread condition that affects 32.5 million adults in the United States. So supposedly, there's only 330 million people in the United States. So that's a good amount. Um, degener degeneration and breakdown of cartilage and the joints. And that's through a lot of these people's foods and diets and uh, the medicine that they're taking. Here's, here's the sad part, okay? Approximately 10% of individuals who need osteoarthritis seek non-invasive treatments and turn to uh, corticosteroid. Uh, I can't say these words, these terms, but um, injections to alleviate their pain. And it's a lot of Edomites that, that are quick to take these injections from Esau Edom, man. To get the pain over with. Something quick. Usually something quick is not sustainable man. So it's saying these injections that these people are taking. 
is causing them to further their condition. Okay? All right. That's what I was saying. Stop the inflammation. Okay? So Esau did his little studies. I'm not going to read the whole thing. But basically, his treatments are these these, shot, these shots and these um, injections, man, is causing them to further have degenerative uh, cartilage, man. Okay? So this, this man is a fraud. He's not a healer. He don't have a healing bone in his body. He is Satan, and he's doing his job very well. All right? So, Lord willing, this lesson was edifying. I want to give all honor, glory, and praises to Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Bahasham, Rekha Shalom.